Los Angeles, California. On a rain slick freeway, tragedy shuts down four lanes of traffic. The semi truck has toppled over. It's a nightmarish accident, and it gets worse. We're told that there's a small car that's pinned underneath. I just need to confirm do we have anyone trapped in the vehicle? Witnesses tell police that the driver is still inside the crushed car. The situation looks grim. These rescuers can't even see what it is that they're trying to uncover. The possibility of anyone surviving underneath tons of steel seems unthinkable. I do have medical attention for you heading that way. But even if the odds are a million to one, emergency crews have to try. Fire and rescue teams working at a breakneck pace. Forming a human conveyor belt, rescuers try to remove as much weight as possible. Next, they attach ropes to the sides. But lifting a truck like this requires heavy machinery. As the crane slowly heaves the trailer up, police and rescuers prepare for the worst. This is extremely dangerous. Finally, they lift away the truck. It looks like he is. He's moving. It's the driver, still breathing. Rescuers quickly use the jaws of life to pry open the mangled door. He's getting out. I don't believe it. Amazingly, the driver steps out and walks away from the wreckage. This is a miracle. Paramedics assist on checking his vital signs and taking every precaution. He's transported to the hospital for observation. But the driver doesn't have a scratch. Even his doctor can't quite believe it. He's done remarkably well for somebody who spent some time under a truck. The driver knows he's cheated death. It was a horrific wreck, and police realize it could have been much worse. I just need to confirm, do we have anyone trapped in the vehicle? Had this man's car gone a foot more in either direction, this trailer... I do have medical 1040 heading that way. ...might have been his tomb.